You may have seen a man with military-style backpack walking down U.S. 60 this week. His name? Captain Nathan Tingle. He's been walking from Louisville to his hometown of Moorhead since this past Sunday afternoon, doing all of it in memory of one of his fallen comrades. ABC 36's Diane Gerstenfeld explains what's motivating him to make this long trek. It's our top story at 11. Step by step, Captain Nathan Tingle is keeping the name of fallen Navy SEAL Colin Thomas of Moorhead alive. We had a lot of the same friends, you know, grew up in the same environment, same neighborhood, so, so uh, had a lot, a lot in common. Thomas was shot and killed while serving in Afghanistan six years ago, but Captain Tingle wasn't able to make it to his funeral. There's uh, not too many guys that come out of Moorhead that, that serve, especially in his capacity, and just knowing that we were all. Uh, we all had this huge circle of friends and just not being able to get back there, it, was, you know, I, it just kind of stayed with me. So he's finishing up a 145-mile journey, or RUCK, as they call it in the military, from Louisville to Moorhead in his honor. Tagging along is Air Force veteran Nicholas Finch. We, we rock all the time, and it's that, that bond um, and that blood, sweat, and tears that we all just kind of instill in ourselves. Um, it's just as close as we can to feel what they might have felt. They're raising money for Special Operations Warrior Foundation, which provides scholarships to the children of fallen servicemen. 93, 94 cents of every dollar they get goes to the families. And so when I think of combining Colin and this charity, I like to think that he is still reaching out, still touching you know, the family members of his fallen teammates even after he's gone. U.S. 60 holds a special place in Captain Tingle's heart. It's the road he used to live on in college and the one Colin used to train on. I know uh, he probably wouldn't want us to, you know, make a big deal about him, but he's not here to object, so we're making a big deal about him. In Bath County, Diane Gersenfeld, ABC 36 News. The pair expect to get to Moorhead tomorrow afternoon for an annual golf scramble in Colin Thomas's name. And this isn't the first time that Captain Tingle has made the journey. Two years ago, he raised nearly $11,000. This year, he's raised the bar, hoping to reach a goal of $25,000. We have a link on how you can help on our website. Just click on the story at WTVQ.com.